So you're thinking about upgrading to a 64-bit version of Windows so that you can run 64-bit versions of software programs or so that your PC can make use of additional memory beyond the 3.5 gigabyte limit of the 32-bit version of Windows. Running 64-bit Windows with lots of memory will improve performance for some programs like CAD, 3D modeling and video editing. Also, if you like to work with several programs running simultaneously and with lots of tabs open in your web browser, it will make your computer more responsive. So, how do you know if your computer can run the 64-bit version of Windows? Fortunately, Windows provides a simple way to check if your machine is capable of running 64-bit Windows. To check on your PC, simply click on the Windows Start menu then select Control Panel. To see all the options, you may have to select large icons from the drop-down menu at the top right of the screen. Now click on Performance Information and Tools. On the right side of the screen, you will see a printer icon and next to it a link to view and print detailed performance and system information. Click on the link. The next screen shows a number of details about your system configuration. If it says yes next to 64-bit capable, your machine will be able to run a 64-bit version of Windows. Finally, before you upgrade, there are a few more things you need to consider. Download 64-bit drivers for all the equipment and devices connected to your PC. This will include your LAN adapter, graphics card and printers. Check the manufacturer's websites for the latest drivers, then download and burn these drivers to a CD or copy to a memory stick. Most importantly, make sure you have a full backup of your PC using the Windows Backup Utility. And remember, if you are planning to upgrade your memory, make sure the new memory matches the specification of any memory modules already installed in your computer.